Welcome to my tutorial on how to make Bion sprites. Alright. First of all, you want to go to a site called spritersresource.com. You can Google it. It's not really hard to find. The name's right there. Alright. Uh, so, you want to find a sprite. There's categories like Nintendo, Sega, Capcom, Square Enix, or other. I chose Nintendo Earthbound, and I'm going to choose one of the Earthbound characters. So I right click it and copy. Okay? Then you open up your Microsoft Paint. I'll just adjust this so you can see. Alright, and then you want to go edit paste. Zoom in uh, quite a fair amount on the item that you want. And you would have to select it. Okay. Make sure that you get the whole image. You could easily miss a pixel so you have to try from the other side sometimes so you can cut it right click and then cut and then go to Beyond Dream Maker New Environment you can give it a name and then File New and then make it an icon file give it the name of the sprite Okay, and click the movie symbol. That one makes animations. And there's uh, directions on which they face, and frames to show the animation. The first frame is just the standing still frame. The next frame is the walking animation. This sprite only has two frames to it. So then I would make it two frames. You want to put the first sprite in it by pasting, edit, paste. And then you want to choose flood. It's on the side. And then right click all the background to make it transparent or see through. Once that's done, you hit back. And this is a special sprite that if you flip it, it'll make an animation. So I'll copy, right click, paste, and then open it up. You want to choose flip. It's that icon right there. And it'll flip the image. So then you go back. And it starts making an animation right there, as you can see. But it's going too fast, but we'll fix that later. Alright, so you want to finish this off. I'll just finish this off here. Paste it in. Align it. Get rid of the background. Copy, paste. Well, you won't have to do that for all the sprites. Just for the ones that are like this. So like every earthbound sprite would be like this. For other sprites, you would just have to grab the other animation and paste it in. These ones are different. You see that they won't exactly align up like the others. That's still okay. Just make sure it's in the center. You want to grab the second animation part. This is what you'll mostly be doing. These ones don't need to be flipped because they're uh, they already have animations to them. Uh, 
and since that one's facing west, facing west, then you can copy it and paste it in there and just flip it the other way. It's really easy to do and it saves a lot of time. So you want to flip and same for the other one. Alright, you have a networking animation, but it's going too fast, so there's a delay. Most people put it t between 1 to 3. 1 is really fast, 2 is like, alright, and 3 is just sort of slow, so I mostly put 2. Then you want to right click it, t um, just because y right now the animation will move if it doesn't have this checked if you stand still it'll move so you want to have the animation play only when you move so you want to choose moving animation you don't need to give it a name you just save you'd only give it a name if uh, if uh, you had more than one animation Alright, you just want to save all, file, save all. It'll save all the icons in your folder. If you make more, it'll still save them all. And then you want to test it out in Bion. Alright, just go to Bion.com. I'm sure you know how. KO Chatters is a, a very good game to test out your icons. You wouldn't want to test it out in like some Dragon Ball Z game. That doesn't make any sense if you did. I'll just adjust the window so you can see. Okay. Create new character. All right. So right now, as you can see, I'm just a KO. So what you would want to do is change the image uh, icon to the one you just made. So I open up Jeff, the one I made. And you just click OK on default icon state. And as you can see, it works perfectly. It does look small, only because my screen recorder. But on yours, it looks perfect. 